Also in some latest news, they attempted to cancel the baby. Yeah. What'd you think about that? They should have canceled him. He should leave them gay motherfuckers alone. Gay people wasn't fucking with him. Yeah, whatever punk do in the parking lot sucking with AJ, they ain't got why he fucking with them gay people. They don't say nothing about the gay niggas in prison. They don't say nothing about all the gay niggas in prison. You think them niggas ain't fucking in prison? And coming back home, sneaking and They ignore all the homies in the set that's fucking them boys. Man, listen. He should stick to rapping and leave them gay motherfuckers alone. Now look at him. He done lost money at the wazoo. And black folks ain't got no platform again. See, once them white folk go to kicking you off their stage, the cold thing about it, black folks ain't got no stage for to go be on. We go clap for him. Yeah, tell him fuck gay people. And soon as he lose all the fame and money, he got to come back over here with us. We ain't got no stage for him. And then we going to start talking about him. Oh, yeah, he can white folk them counsel him now. All them, yeah. So he should have left them white folks alone. You saw what he did. Did you see him meet with them 12 World AIDS organizations and gay groups? You saw I heard about something like yeah, that. Yeah, you see yeah. him. Yeah, so now he, he, back, he backpedaling now. He's saying, I'm sorry, gay people. Who dick I need to suck now? Now he want to suck dick. Nigga losing all that kind of money. Yeah, he backpedaling now. Oh, I want to meet with everybody now. Because he see black folks ain't got no safety net for him. So stay over there with white folks, the baby. Don't trust them. Yeah, leave them gay motherfuckers alone. So you believe he should have been canceled? Yeah. Yeah. You think apologizing he should get another chance? Well, uh, apologizing is like sucking a dick. So yeah, yeah. If he go apologize to gay people, let him back in, gay people. That means he y'all done broke his spirits. I ain't apologizing to the Crips and Bloods. I'm, I would never apologize to the Crips and Bloods. So what I'm saying here, same with Nick Cannon. When you get on a white boy's television and you got to go put the video on YouTube, don't forget, man, that's them white folks shit. You can't say nothing bad about these people and this is their platform. If you want to say something bad about me, nigga, get off my platform. Don't that make sense? The gays is running the entertainment industry now. The gays is running Hollywood. The gays is running YouTube. The gays is running Netflix. Why would they allow you to get on their stage? This is their stage. Why would gay people let you get on their big platform and bash them? Get off our stage. Go build you a stage, nigga, over there with your people and see how far you go without us. So it's only right that gay people counsel a nigga that talk about gay people. They rule in the world now. They wasn't fucking with him. Why are you fucking with them? To stay on the subject of the baby, Dave Chappelle had his Netflix special where he referenced the baby at one point killed somebody in Walmart. And then, you know, he offended gay people. And, you know, he said that when he killed somebody, nothing bad happened to his career versus when he offended people, he was canceled. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Uh, well, that's why I love gay people and white people. They go always remind a black motherfucker he ain't nothing but a nigga. And I think that's the best place every black person need to be in. Remind that you ain't nothing but a nigga. So don't get out your place, nigga. You a nigga in America, nigga. These people make laws over you. You don't own nothing. You ain't got no banks. You ain't got no military force. You ain't got nobody you can send to Congress to help shape laws in this country. Y'all ain't got no more. Uh, what's that O.J. Simpson lawyer name, that nigga? What's that Johnny Cochran? Y'all ain't got no more Johnny Cochran, nigga. Y'all ain't got no rights. Only rights you black motherfuckers in America got is to sing and dance and run fast and jump high, nigga. We don't want to hear about what y'all don't like. So, yeah, you can kill a nigga all day long and we'll promote you. But you go to saying something about our gay boys, if you go to fucking with our stray dogs, you go to fucking with our stray cats, you niggas better not kill a bird. 
we'll put your ass in the ground. So niggas must forgot this is America. White boy do what he want to do to niggas. I always have been. We his niggas. We ain't, yeah, yeah, we his niggas. And we ain't going to say nothing. So they kick Dave Chappelle off. Who go get Dave Chappelle the platform? Tyler Perry? No, no, uh, Dave Chappelle wasn't canceled. But they need to cancel him. Netflix, yeah, they need to cancel Dave uh, Chappelle. stood up to the gay community and, and refused to cancel him. Yeah, yeah, they need to cancel. Leave gay people alone. They run the world now. They run the penitentiaries and they run the world. Don't you think it's just jokes, though? Oh, uh, well, the Crips and Bloods fucking with me by my jokes. What's the difference? They, the Crips and Bloods, what's the difference between what I'm saying online? I'm not hitting nobody. I'm not threatening nobody. What's the difference between my jokes and Dave Chappelle jokes? Well, when I watch Dave Chappelle, I know I'm watching comedy. When I watch you, I feel like it's real. Hold on, hold on. You say you feel. I already said I'm in character. Before, when well, I, when I, hold on, but, no, but you just say I feel. I'm in comedy. I didn't know you was in comedy. I've well, never well, knew that but, before. But, but hold on. But I said from the start, I'm in character. I said from my first Say Cheese TV interview that I'm playing a character. I sat down with every blog and said, hey, I seen Dolomite. I seen the movie Dolomite. I created this character. I've been saying that the whole time. I've been saying that the whole, and, and then it will, in real life, I'm a community activist. He ain't no, this, so I've been saying on the internet, I'm a character. In real life, y'all, this is what I do. Hey, Google my name, this is what I do. Hey, all the blogs, hey, what, man, this, I work on capital murder and death penalty cases. I'm a law-abiding citizen. So how could you not think this was comedy? And I'm telling y'all, been saying it for almost a year now. But you said, I feel. Because what I did, I learned in college, homie. I learned how to evoke feelings by oral speaking, public speaking. I learned to use shock value in my professional speaking classes at the university. So I play on emotions like every great author, like every great film writer, like every great comedian. I peeped the weakness in this shit. And I told y'all, hey, this is what I'm finna do, y'all. But because y'all got caught up in the feelings of what y'all feel about what I say, hey, so don't say nothing about the gays saying nothing to Dave Chappelle when I'm getting attacked for simply just talking. Yeah, I believe recently uh, some transgender employees at Netflix are planning a walkout in protest because they're not canceling Dave Chappelle. Yeah, they need to be fired for insubordination. Yeah, yeah, them transgender motherfuckers need to be fired for insubordination. Hopefully, uh, wherever the YouTube headquarters is, it's a state like Texas, an at-will state, a motherfucking fire you for a part in your head. You want them fired, okay? Yeah, yeah, I want them transgender motherfuckers fired. Insubordination.